What's up, y'all? <clears throat> How y'all feeling about R. Kelly? Because in my opinion, man, it's going to hit the fan. Whether he win or lose, he still lose. He can't recoup the money back, and he can't sell records like he used to. So it's a lose-lose for him even if he win it. It's going to hit the fan, though. Either it's going to be entertaining or it's going to be the, the saddest thing we ever ever seen. I really don't care about the person. I don't know R. Kelly. I ain't never met him. So I just listen to his music. His music, I still like. The world's greatest and when the woman's fed up and body's calling and, you know, he, man, ignition. And he has so many songs, man. So many songs he wrote. Dro wrote Joe's more and more. Man, Maxwell, fortunate. Like, you know, I like R. Kelly and what, what he's done for music. But it's gonna hit the fan. Then he got this living girl, these two living girlfriends that people are saying they brainwashed and they trying to figure out when R. Kelly got them and everything. Here's the thing: these are two women, in my opinion, that are old enough to make their own decisions. I personally cannot say you're brainwashed because you don't do what I want you to do. They might like the lifestyle. Now, was it abuse going on? Probably. But they like the lifestyle. They like the, the limousines and we going to shows and they ain't trying to go back to somebody playing something. They ain't trying to go back to the regular lifestyle that they used to. Now they pursuing acting careers and modeling careers and you got access. They like that. That's the way I saw it. There's so many people that, that would put up with certain things be, because of a financial gain that they get out of it. It's going to hit the fan though. Everybody talking about R. Kelly gonna commit suicide and all this. I don't know. I can't do 30 years in prison. Now, I'm an upstanding citizen, man. I do everything I can, man, to treat people re with respect. And I love everybody. And I'm not saying that that's always works, but I can't do that, man. He facing 75 years. And I heard somebody say he facing 195 years. That's a long time, man. And especially he's 52. So even if he was facing 30 years, that means he'd be he'd be 82, 83, whenever they would uh go on with the trial. I don't know. He lying, they lying, and he telling the truth, and they telling the truth. Does that make sense to you? Everybody in the wrong. But if he beat this, he still lose. He cannot make no more albums. He's 52. He can't recoup none of the money he lost. So I, And then, if even if he did beat it, people still going to look at him like they do Michael and say he was a child molester or he was or whatever. So, man, it's, it's, ooh, he in a tough spot. He in a real tough spot. Y'all think about R. Kelly. Y'all think he guilty? Because some of the stuff, it do look like he could be guilty. But then when you look at the other side of it, I could be like, I could see where the payouts happen. But if I got a 13, 14 year old daughter, I ain't taking no payout for you to molest her or you to sleep with her. I don't get how you could take a payout for R. Kelly to touch on your daughter and do all this with your daughter and find out with your kids or whatever he did. And then 15 years later, complain about it. You paid. You took the payout. So that means you was consenting to it as a parent, if that's what happened. Some wrong people, and there's people just do anything for some money, man. And it's, it's things in this world you gotta say no to. Can't just go on for the ride. Can't take one for the team. Man, it could be tough because these two girls, his living girlfriends, if if they want to close this case and end it for him for real, all they had to do was say, yep, all these other girls that accused R. Kelly is telling the truth. And that's a sealed case right there. Now R. Kelly got all these sex tapes they got out now. They claiming they got witnesses. If these witnesses potentially come forward. Man, they proved that they was actually 12, 13, 14 in these videos. Man, it's sad that a man got in his career like that. I wish, though, even though they won't do it, but he's in jail. R. Kelly's in jail now, but I wish they would give him his computer. He won his computer so he could finish up his latest album. I want to hear that latest album. I know people like mute R. Kelly. I want to hear his latest album. I want to hear what he's going to say. I'm an R&B fan. I like the craft of R&B. And that'll never end. I don't, I, what he did, that's, that's separate, but... I'm an R&B fan. It ain't gonna happen, but wishful thinking. A man gonna do 75 years. Let me get one more album. Wishful thinking, though. We need one more album. Might be his best album to date, but ain't nobody gonna hear it but me. Let me know what y'all thought. 
I'm up out of here, man. I might come back with another video with this because I know it ain't over yet. Every day is something different. Got his girl, man. His living girlfriend doing acting and modeling stuff. Oh, it's going to hit the fan, baby. It's going to hit the fan, baby. <laughs> I'm out. I said I'm out.